Hi guys, got a question from Abhishek Sharma. He's querying a little video he's seen on the use of transistors and I just thought I'd see if I could duplicate it just so I can talk through what's happening. It's a very simple circuit, it's just a single transistor lighting up a single LED. So I've got my scrap boxes here. I've got a breadboard here. So we need a resistor. That one looks about right. I think that's black, brown, brown, brown. No say that again the right way round, brown, black, 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 which is one, zero, 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 that's either a hundred ohms or something like that. Easy way to do is check it, isn't it? Need an LED. LEDs. That's a little button so I use just for checking my LEDs. As you can see I've got quite a few in there, loose. Transistor. Ooh, diodes as transistors. Diodes and transistors as this box says. says BC547 on it. It's probably as good as any. Find out in a minute. All that a breadboard is, is it's a load of little connectors in there that grip the wires when you push them in so you don't need to solder them. So, which way do we want to do this? It's just a demonstration of turning the transistor on. The resistor is to limit the current going through the diode, uh, LED. I've got my little battery pack here from an old torch. It's got three AAA batteries in it, so that's, uh, I would say four and a half volts, but they're rechargeable, so that's about 3.6 volts. And I've got some connector wires here. In fact, the first thing I'll do is check the LED works. So if we go across the resistor, right, that's on. So if I connect it, I suppose I ought to go close up mode, shouldn't I? I've bent things around a bit so we can see them clearly. There's the LED. 
that's the negative of the battery on that wire. That's our 100 ohm resistor. That's our transistor. And that's the positive of our battery just there. And to make the LED light, we need to turn the transistor on. And the way you normally do that is by connecting, in this case, the positive to the middle terminal on the transistor, which is the base. So if I just, in fact, if I do it this side, I can touch it and you can see it. There we go. Now that's giving it the full voltage, but we can do it using a resistance. In fact, that's the normal way of doing it. So if I connect this wire to the same middle, just demonstrate touching those two wires together. Do that in shot. There we go. And the video that Sharma, sorry, Abhishek Sharma was interested in was the person was touching these two terminals and turning the LED on. And as you can see, it works. Because all we're doing is using my skin and my body as a resistance path to complete the circuit. In fact, if I wet my fingers, it'll probably light up a bit brighter. There we go. Because wet fingers are a lower resistance. And that's it. That's all that the video that he was querying shows. It's how to switch on a transistor.